So it's a super gray day here in Toronto, Canada. The weather makes me a little depressed. And what do you do when you're depressed? You eat. What do I do when I'm not depressed? I eat. I eat because I'm unhappy. I'm unhappy because I eat. So we're gonna eat. Today I'm gonna show you guys 10 of my favorite Canadian foods. This is stuff that I eat when I come back home. It's that stuff that you can't find in America. Instead of starting with breakfast, I'm gonna jump right into candy. For all my American fans out there, we're gonna keep this simple. You want these first few items? 7-Eleven it is. I was honestly gonna wait and pull over and set this up and do this properly, but my mouth is fucking watering. Lay's ketchup chips. Canadian staple probably heard of this and in case you haven't you should look it up so what I'm gonna do for you guys is I'm going to link every item that I can in my description so you can order it on Amazon if you want to try them out I highly recommend it and if you don't eat your but these if God had a vagina it would smell like this look at that thing this red goodness these are actually the best chip flavor in the world. It's a beautiful thing. Canadian candy time. Let's talk about chocolate bars. Probably the best one you'll ever try. Crunchy sponge toffee. Look at that. Cadbury. The reason a lot of these aren't in America is because Cadbury is English. You can find all this stuff in England. Do you like Dax? Dax. What? Yeah, Dax. Dax. Do you like Dax? Oh, dogs. Bet you didn't know that. Another Canadian chocolate bar staple, coffee crisp. This is actually a new flavor I've never heard of called caramel macchiato. Usually it's just coffee crisp. And yes, it tastes like coffee, which may sound weird, but it's also amazing. I don't know how I feel about this new flavor, but it's pretty good. Next on my list, the sour key large these come in this size small and large i couldn't find the large at the 7-eleven i went to but i've ate about 500 on this trip home i've only been here a week these are amazing i'm linking these in the description below try them you'll eat the whole container all right let's get some more could i do a super kid on one of these like sprinkle cones Thank you. Guys, they call this the Super Kid. From Laura Secord, Canadian as hell. Best ice cream you'll ever have. It's like some rainbow flavor. I don't even know exactly what the flavor is, but it's incredible and I highly recommend this. Oh, Canada, I love you. In the most Canadian place in the universe, Tim Hortons, around the corner from the Hockey Hall of Fame. This is the most Canadian thing you've ever seen. Tim Horton drive through basically the Starbucks of Canada. The most Canadian thing you can do. 10 Timbits? 10 Timbits, sure. You like just like a Can I do uh, two birthday cake, two chocolate, two uh, Dutchie? Do you have apple fritter? Yes, we do. Honey dip? Did I already say that? Uh, no. Hi, Hi how are you? Fine. Thank you. Thank you. So when you order Timbits, it comes in this cute little box. A luggage for donuts. That's where you stash the dough. Side note here, Tim Horton was actually a famous hockey player who played for the Toronto Maple Leafs, in case you didn't know. Better luck next year. <laughs> <laughs> now that wasn't very nice. <laughs> but yo, fire. Birthday cake. Birthday cake Timbits. Donut holes, whatever you want to call them, they're amazing. What is poutine? Great question, with hundreds of different answers. It began as a Canadian specialty made from french fries, cheese curds, and seasoned brown gravy. Cherry on top of the Canadian food, the poutine. This is the best. Trust me. Poutine gives me the, just the worst sh**. <laughs> <laughs> 
So that's gonna wrap it up here today. Unfortunately, I had to come back to LA for another project that I'm working on last minute. I wasn't able to complete my list of 10 items. We only got to seven, but lucky for you guys, I am the dad bod god, and the next time I go back, I will finish that list plus an additional 10. So thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment down below if you are Canadian and you think I missed something that I should include. How about that, eh? Please have your passports and declaration forms out and ready. Thanks for watching, live large. Ciao. Oh God. Sorry, I farted. <laughs>